Hey guys, it's Anelius and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. We're currently playing, of course, as Asterion, and we're basically doing the final bits of the Githyanki crash. So at the end of the last episode, we basically made our way back to camp because we did just need to do a bit of resting up. We just did need to basically also see where we stood in terms of all the equipment we have. All right, as you can see, we got lots of Githyanki crossbows. They are worth some money, not a heck of a lot, but at least some money. We should be able to sell them. Lots of other gear as well, which will be nice to be able to take care of. We got the scented amulet here. Um, a ring of absolute force. Okay, I haven't got many rings lying around here. Yeah, the, the absolute stuff doesn't really do it for me at the moment. Um, I've got better than this already. I've got the ones that give me... Sorry, I was just distracted. Um, I've basically got ones that give me already the misty step here. And I cannot be enwebbed and so forth. Well, that's the flaming fist one that we got there. Okay. We got a broken moon lantern. Assume nothing. Oh yeah, this I want to basically send this back to camp as well. That can go back to camp. That can go back to camp as well. That can go back to camp. I really need to make sure I sort it after every individual time. Okay. Eager for battle. This is focused upon Githyanki, which is great. Guidance is really useful. What does that ancient grudges mean? Touch your amulet to sub subsume a sliver of the knowledge of the gith. You gain advantage on attack rolls against aberrations. Well, I'm not facing an aberration at the moment, but it's good to be aware of. Okay, what is this? Uh, hold on, where did I just go? of course the egg uh, okay that's apparently fits on the head that's not really something we want to do is it Hello. same with this one jolt shooter electric hmm I'm not really that into the lightning charges, so I'm going to basically send this back to camp. Same with that one. I mean, the misty step, though, is quite useful to have. I'm not sure what I can do with that, but maybe later that could be of some use. Watch your back. As you can see, I only got one ring on at the moment. I have the magic touch. Color spray. Hmm, maybe. Close. Well... Oh, where? At least I got something on my finger, Black. you could argue. Done. Not sure why we took it out of the bag. I just wanted to sort the bag, but okay, that's fine. Blades always sharp. I've got way too much on me. Way too much. This can go to camp, that's for sure. That can go to camp. Steel forged sword. Yeah, great sword, but I don't want to use it. I'm not even sure why I'm carrying half of this stuff. This is, of course, a very, very interesting one. It's got finesse and so forth on there. Um, this I was thinking I might want to use here. So this does 8 to 21. Yeah, that's not really worth it, is it? Ever burning blade. Uh, the dark just the core stuff is potentially useful. Helm protection when you heal another creature, it gains resistance against bludgeoning, etc. etc. What am I wearing at the moment? Troubadour's Wonder. Your armor class increased by one. In addition, if you have Bard Inspiration, you gain one more use of it. Which is great, of course, for a Bard, but I'm not a Bard. But that doesn't really matter because I'm getting so much use out of it. I'm getting one extra armor class. Look at this. 
AC20. You don't see many of the clerics with, uh, with that kind of armor class. The Blast Pendant, Lightning Blast. Okay. A couple of mysteries. I'm currently wearing the one that basically gives me Wounding Rate and Rate of Fear. I'm, I'm not quite sure if that is the ultimate one. I know it's, it's a purple one, which is supposed to be better than blue. But at the same time, it's like, mm, okay, really? Okay, put all the potions back in there. Open it up, expand it, and then sort it. Because again, I'm pretty sure that they haven't stacked. As you can see, nope, no stacking. And as you can see, there's also a limit in how far they can stack. Those can stack. It's a bit of uh, inventory management. It would be great if there were some more features around inventory management in the game itself. But it isn't to be, it looks like, which is well, okay. I guess we can live with that. Let's resort this after I've done that one. I could stack that one still. Those are slightly different, but they're similar in yeah appearance to some extent. Potentially a little bit confusing because they look so similar, but that, that's about the extent of it. Um, hmm, smite the Graceless. Yeah, let's sort all of our stuff here as well. All right. Don't. Sorry, I've been holding you long enough. Let's get out of here. We're of course in the Githyanki Infirmary at the moment. <clears throat> I've emptied pretty much everything here already. Boom. Okay, let's go. There's not much left of everything here. There's, of course, the hatchery that we can still deal with. Now, the final question, of course, might be, do you really want to basically obliterate the entire Githyanki crash? I'm not sure that would make You've never been born. our friend too happy. Lizelle. Shall we cut and run? Okay, that one is there. There's blood in the air. Can I step to them? Okay. Ah, they managed to counterspell me. Interesting. Ooh, Varsh. Koku. Get Yonki Warm Magic. Okay. Did I put fair or anything wow look at the actual damage i managed to do crikey may the dice roll in my favor it shall be done bone chill yeah there's a range of options for me to go for Zell got haste on her. I'm ready. Okay. Okay, Gail got. Again, I forgot. I forgot to, of course, put mage armor on myself. A ray of frost. Why do we skip Lazel? 
because I guess she doesn't want to fight here in reality, does she? On the move. Okay. Really? You counterspelled that as well? Counterspell and a healing spell. Oh wow. Well in reality of course it's your choice, but yeah. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Cost me a bit of effort to get up there. Over here. A tale for the ages. Indeed, it is a tale for the ages. Now, the beauty of that is it's a concentration spell. Uh. We can keep it active for a while. Okay, concentration save made. We rally themselves. Taste my fury. One, two. Really? I'm pretty sure I cast haste upon you. Maybe I didn't. Interesting. Lazel got hurt. How lovely. Okay, he parried that. Take your hero. Well, good luck in counterspelling that if there's no more mage to do the counterspelling. Nice. Time to move. Okay, let's do the force tunnel here. Oh, that has to be at the same level, doesn't it? Okay. Survival instinct? I don't need survival instinct at the moment. Indeed. I need that teeny bit of healing. Okay. She gets hurt. That's fine. Oh, she's got acid resistance at the moment. Again, you try to, of course, go for Gale. Gale is the weak one. Make way. Still wearing the actual correct boots, which is good. Okay, that resets on a short rest, which is great. Okay, again, I miss. Interesting. Should have put that on from the very beginning, but never mind. There you go, Gail. Heal up. Let's go. Yeah, sure. Okay. Let's make sure I put the mage armor on myself this time. Duh. Smart. Again, you go for Gale. Critical miss. Perfect. And you still hit me. Despite things. 
misty step. Okay. Okay. Do a quick rest. Sit in us. Now, forward. Disarm that. The guidance doesn't hurt. A little the modifiers will get there. Relatively easily. These two will basically go back to camp again. Okay, let's have a look. See here. Are there more around here, or is that the extent of it? I do rather suspect that's the full extent of it. Okay. Oh, enough waiting. I crave blood. Okay, that was a little bit too far, wasn't it? What lies within? Nothing else here? Hmm, okay. I had to some extent hoped that there would be slightly more. I'll basically make it such that it won't do much. Or it will be my asthma. Bush. Okay, let's send this up to camp as well. spell, isn't it? It's only him that needs a bit of healing. Take you, you One with the weave. Oh. Ah, keep your distance, darling. Okay. Step lightly. Let's get out of here. I do believe I've basically pretty much looted all of them. Probably get the Yankee. What's in here? Okay. All right. Rosymorn Monastery. And of course, we will make our way back towards wherever we were outside. I don't think there's much else we can do here, really. Yeah, you might remember that we did try to basically get the, the blood thing to work, but yeah, it didn't seem to do whatever we wanted it to do, so we're going to let that be. Unfortunately, this novice of the absolute is dead. Well, unfortunate for him, I should say. What we should really do is we should go to our little lady. And let her cast long stride on everybody. Makes everybody that little bit quicker. More nimble on their feet, maybe I should say. All right, there we go. Delicious. Watch the shadows. <clears throat> All right. What else could we do? 
Is there a path to follow in that direction? I don't see a path. So I rather suspect we need to go here. Let's uh, just fast travel there. Saves us that precious bit of time that we would otherwise waste on trying to get over things we can't get over. Hold on. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Can I see anything more like that? No, I cannot. Okay, let's go down here. And then if we take a left here, All right. there's a plaque there. Ooh, there's balsam there as well. In the way of dawn, for Lathander cannot protect you where the lights doth not reach. What have we here? Okay. Let's make our way there. That can go to Gale. That can go in there. Ooh, who's that? Look at that. Who do we meet here? We meet by our way, along the way, a wary traveler. <laughs> Who there, wanderer? Stay thy course a moment to indulge an old man. Elminster? The very same, Gale. And a fair bit miffed he is, too. Finding himself forced to expose his best pair of boots to so many miles of country road on, on my behalf. behalf. Oh, lovely. So what I'm going to say. Meet Elminster Ormar. A good friend of mine, but rather more significantly, he's the most famed and respected wizard in the realms. Am I indeed? Most famed and respected errand boy, more life. I was bid to spare neither time nor my own self to find you. She sent me, Gale. You know of whom I speak. But why? Mistra. Out with it, Elminster. Please. Young man, has your sojourn away from Bordity washed away your decorum as well as your patience? Nigh a ten day I've gone without honest fare, worthy of the name, drank naught, but what the sky entitled my thirst. Why, so okay. bread, cheese, and a cup of wine would appear unto me a feast. Surely you will begrudge me a mite of rest and repast before I get out with it. <laughs> And a great kindness that would be. Seagate? Oh. Uh, okay. This way then. To your camp. Oh, don't dawdle now, lad. You're the one who's in such a frightful hurry. Oh, nigh on 13 centuries old and he still thinks with his stomach. We'd best follow and see if he's more disposed to speak plainly once it's stopped its grumbling. Okay. Wise choice. Better to end. All right, there we go. Hello. What a delightful wedge of old Elf Turin that was. I'm assuming you're talking about cheese. To parlay on an empty stomach, you know. Next ones were plenty to digest. After all, good deal to Elminster. I. Okay. My boy, I've come to address a most. I'm here. On behalf of Mistra, the message and the charge I bring you are hers. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mistra's delicate feet are ill suited for the hardship. You know where you went wrong, Gale. No. Okay. Well, uh, Mistra would consider. She would consider. Mistra is aware of the misadventures that have befallen you both. 
She knows of your strife with the Absolute, that most insidious of evils. Okay. Alas, the creature that afflicts you, the ill mm -hmm. gotten magic that it we you must know that the absolute is more dangerous than you can possibly. That is why I have come here to charge you, Gale, with its destruction. Okay. It is Mistress Belief. That only you can. Oh, wow. The orb. The orb. Precisely. Mistra has granted me the power to stop the clock, as it were, on the orb's rush to overpower you. Instead, you will be able to unleash its lethal combustion at will. Interesting. This could be a hindrance. We shall have to see. You must find the heart of the absolute, whatever that may be, and use yourself as the uh, catalyst that will burn it from this world. Okay. Wow. He is not. It brings me no pleasure saying this, my friend. Mm -hmm. But such is Mistress Will. Yours must be the sack. With that, I've said my sorry piece. And need only bestow unto thee the charm I was bid. Aha. It is done. Both charge and charm have been committed into your care. Lovely. To you, I commit into care Gail himself. I count on you to shepherd him well on this strangest of journeys okay on my honor i'm not sure yet i can say the same like moons make swell and wane the nescient seas so too the skies truven gods ordain the tidal fates of mortal days and yet a notion born in lonely hours. Come, ebb, come, flow, come. All that is beyond the breadth of our dominion. Be a moon unto yourself. Even the waves of fate can break upon the shores of will. Farewell, my friend. Farewell, Elminster. I'm glad she chose you. Indeed. Wow. No rest for the wicked us. What does it now say? Okay. Robes of summer. Am I wearing the robes of summer? It looks like. What a day. Indeed. Let's go and speak to our friend Gail here. An audience with Elminster is never less than memorable. I'd have hoped to introduce you to him in less dire circumstances. But those are hard to come by these days. Indeed. The doddering act is merely an illusion, one he's most adept at maintaining. Elminster, for Mistra to have sent him. Uh -huh. The severity of her bidding could not time seem so infinite when you're young. A month is an age. A year is a lifetime. And there's a... Of course. 
They offer the clearest solution to our problem. All I have to do is find the right place and time, close my eyes, and let go. Then the okay. Will be clean, and I along with it. Okay. If there was, that remains ahead of us for now. The heart of the absolute must be discovered before I can stop its beating. Then I suppose there is nothing more to be done but find the heart of the absolute and stop its beating. Right, I guess you're repeating yourself pretty much, but that's okay. Okay, I still got most of my spells left, that's fine, and same here. More Mugworth here. Step quick. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get out of here. We didn't actually do a long rest. We we're just conversing with, of course, our friend. There's a dead blue jay. Don't mind if I do. Okay, can I resurrect these? No. Not a blue jay there. Why do all the birds and all the other creatures die here? This. Okay, I can go to the shadow cursed lands from here. Hmm. Let's just double check. Ah, there is another thing we need to do. We need to go back to the Emerald Grove environs and speak to Wrath, because it says that Wrath would reward us. Hold on. What are we doing? I'm pretty sure I set it to do a long... Whoa. Okay. Has our queen sent an such informality, child? Mm -hmm. Does just still Kithrak not command your your blade speaks for you, Kithrak? Child of Gith, I've not come to kill you. Don't trust him. Mm -hmm. Skakak Kir Gith Shabeleth, my blade rests. Mother Gith compels you to listen. Okay. Speak. My ear is yours. I know you carry the astral prism, Lazel. Within it lies mm -hmm. the seed of Vlakith's demise. And I intend. Vlakith's demise? Skaketh! I should run you through for suggesting it. I'm asking for your help. And your trust. I've heard word from Kresh Yilik. You are infected. Yet the one in the prism has chosen you. Protect you. The prism's tenant alone has the power to... I've sought their freedom for eons. Mm -hmm. Instead, all that remains is the key that unchains them. Bring the prism to Baldur's Gate. I'll be waiting in a taproom called Shares's Caress. Lazel. Together we will break. I am no slave, just still Kithrak. The Undying Queen is my freedom. It is lies, Lazel. Every last one. The Zaith Isk does not purify. It extracts memory and kills the infected. Ah. Nor does the Lich Queen glorify the Ascended. She feeds on most all of them to grow her power. Madness. I. I will hear no more of it. Okay. Blacketh the whole of my life. 
I will meet you in both. Lazel, I see to la Take this. It is a Quanith. The Queen's warriors hunt you. The Quanith okay. will sound you out when you come near their portals. Hear its cry and prepare for battle or slip away. I should go. Vlakith's gaze pierces the seas and skies. She believes me, Lord. Keep the astral prism close. Let no okay. one take it from you. Now to Baldur's Gate. Okay. Oh, action, not reaction. Trust no one. Okay. Hello, lover. Vlakith cost seven hearth crashed. These were the first words, but they are no mere aphorism. The For mm -hmm. save one protocol, if Voss speaks true, she has sinned against me. Ascension is a young gift, young. Long ago, the Gaith enslaved my people. From the day of our hatching, then we speak the right of it. We are honored with an eternal home in the astral. Celebrated. I never thought Vlakith a tyrant or me as a vassal, a warrior. But if Voss is right, and Vlak, then I am no destroyer. I am mere. Every Gith Yankee is a slave with a single mm -hmm. purpose not to cull the Gaith. Not to prevent, but to raise Vlakith to true godhood. I don't know. At first, I thought them a... But the dream figure... Voss believes they are the seed of Vlakith's demise. And I believe he may be right. Yes. We'll meet Kithrak Voss at Charesse's caress in both mm -hmm. of An unhurt, and yeah, keep it close, and don't you dare pass it to that. We must press four. Right, so no romance with her, it looks like. Any romance with her? I didn't expect Lazel to turn on the Lich Queen so readily. Wonders never cease. Very serious of you. But even if I could remember, I'm not sure I'd tell you. I don't want your e Fine. What's on your mind? Quite splendidly, to give credit where it's due. You know, I think very serious of you. But even if I could remember, I'm not sure I'd tell you. Fine. What's on... Quite splendidly, to give credit... Okay, that doesn't really do much, does it? Is that because I had a night with someone else? I'm not sure. Where is our good friend? I got her, I got her. Am I missing? I'm missing some folks. Never mind. Anyways, um I have to do a long rest, it looks like. I'm being forced to. Did it consume any food items or other consumables? I'm not sure. Okay, so what I wanted to do, I wanted to basically head back to the grove, the Emerald Grove. Because I think we might have actually missed something there. Did we make it there? Yep. Yes, we did. There's lots of blood here, which is fine. And of course, we got Jora, Tusk, and so forth here. Thank you very much. Okay. Yes, we've grown in strength since our last visit to here. 
but a reasonable amount, I would say. Let's pull the lever. Lever, lever, lever. Okay, there's gold there, there's Ooh, dagger root there. Wrath. Is that his name again? There is Wrath. Really? Hello, Wrath. By your efforts, Sylvanas's grace can be restored. Helsin thanked us and said that Wrath would surely reward us. Okay, well. Let's go to camp briefly. What does Helsin have to say? You wish to speak? Impressive. Mm -hmm. Most would quake at the mere thought of delving that far into the Underdark. What did you find? Hmm. Keep looking. It may prove impossible to avoid the Shadow Curse entirely. But if you find any way to... With such stimulating company? Okay. Hey, Karlak. So we're going to meet Voss in the city, are we? Set the tenant of the prison free? This is all very, uh... I don't know. I like a good cape. Where would you start? Mm-hmm. <sighs> you give me chills, baby. No mean feet at my temperature. Gods, we better find a way to cool me off soon. I'm not sure. <laughs> All right. So, what else do we need? Okay, let's get out of there. It doesn't look like I need anything else from here at the moment. Help get rid of Ross. Okay. Find the Blood of the Thunder. Companion's Daughter of Darkness. Computed quests. Okay, we're good here, I think. Why does that not move down there? All right, let's go back to where we were earlier. It's a different realm. Do you want to venture forth? Yes, I do want to venture there. Same as before, let's follow that same path as we did earlier. We're going to head over here, and then from there we're going to go over there. And that's the portal to the next section, basically. That's the broken bridge. This is the alternative here. Now, there should be an inn that we can go to. All right, let's make our way there to the Shadow Curse Lands. 
I've not come across the inners of yet. Hmm, interesting. Plot thickens, is what it said. The plot thickens. Leave Act 1 for somewhere altogether darker. So this should be Act 2. So we finalized Act 1 here, finally. And at the moment it looks like 52.6% of players have actually done the same. How lovely. That's no ordinary darkness. Hello. Uh, are you the true soul? I'll take that as a yes. Grab a torch, stay out of the dark, and move fast. The shadows have eyes. Okay. Grab a torch from where? Ah, there. Can I equip the torch? I can. Eager for battle. Okay, can I grab another one here? Is there only one torch? No, there's a second one here. I will take my pick. Nope. Okay, well, let's have a look. See here. Stick about. Her torch will keep you. I'll keep an eye for other truce. Other true souls, okay. Crowded in no ordinary shadows. What evil lurks within such darkness? Well, maybe that's actually a great point in time to basically call it a day. So we're going to basically save the game here, and I'll see you in the next episode. In the meantime, take care.